So here's your first pelvic floor exercise. Depending on how comfortable your knees are, you're going to sit on a stack of towels. Just go to the linen closet and see what's there. You're going to sit on a stack of towels so you have pressure against your perineum, against your pelvic floor, yes, against your balls. You're going to try to, um, to just sort of sense where the pressure is from the towels. Then put your fingertips inside your hip bones and lift the boys up. Lift your balls up off the towel, a little higher, a little higher, without moving your bones, without moving your legs, without moving your body. Just lift that tissue up and then release. Lift up and then release. Lift up and then release. You're going to do 15, 20, 200, 300 of these over time during the day. Now try to draw your tailbone up around underneath you to the waistband of your shorts. Draw under without tipping your pelvis, without moving your bones, just the muscles. Draw your tailbone up around to your pubic bone. So the muscles almost feel like they're starting in the back and coming forward? Yes, okay. almost like in the lower back, but the very lowest part of your back to your pubic bone okay. or to your waistband, all the way up. I mean, bring it on up and then release. Wrap around and then release. One more time, wrap around and then release. So almost a feeling of moving the hips forward without moving the hips forward. Correct? Exactly. Okay. It's the muscles between your hip bones that you're moving forward. Got it. Okay, now stack your ribs right over your hips. Good. Draw your sitting bones together, your butt bones. Draw your sits bones toward each other. And release. So, so now I'm trying to tighten my butt. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of like you're closing your okay. anal sphincter a little. It's like that 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 and then go higher than that. Like not just the anal sphincter, but think about what comes up underneath there. <laughs> and then release. Now can you bring that forward a little and think about your sits bones pushing forward and crushing your prostate. I love that. Yeah. That pain in the ass prostate. <laughs> Draw forward and then release. Draw your sits bones toward your prostate. Squish your prostate with your muscles and then release. So that's five separate exercises as opposed to just one that we typically hear about for the Kegel exercise. Oh, the Kegel exercise, the stopping the flow of urine. Yes, that's just, it's just all on the surface. You have so much more than that. There are arguably five layers in the pelvic floor. Keep going. Um, yeah, so now, just for fun, this is one of my favorites. Put your uh, hip fingers inside your hip bones. Draw your right sits bone to your left fingertips. See if you can sense that diagonal, because there are muscle fibers that work on the diagonal. Find that sensation. Sits bone to fingertips. Now when I say that, notice if you're rocking on the towels. You don't need to rock. You're just activating the muscles. Steve's doing a great job, but usually the first time I teach this, people will go, no, 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 no. Hold your body still and move the muscle that direction. Now go the other way. Left sits bone up to your right fingertips. And then release. Left sits bone to your right fingertips. So it's like I'm drawing yes. things this way. Uh huh. And before and I was then, drawing it that way. Right. Okay. So that'll give me some type of transversal strength. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Now, can you um, bring the base of your penis back toward your tailbone? And release. That's even a different feeling. Uh -huh. Bring the base of your penis back toward your tailbone, underneath your body, between your legs. I feel like I'm scooping in my stomach as well at the same time. It happens. It's just a, it's a two for one. You, mm -hmm. you do get your TVA to activate, but don't make the abdominal wall the focus. There are other videos, and we'll even make some, that, that work on getting your six pack back. That's a different issue. This is more uh, between your legs, pelvic floor from the base of your penis back up to your tailbone. Those muscles are, are what we're working on the pelvic floor. Great. This is just a byproduct and it's a great one. Good. Base of your penis back to your tailbone. And lift. And release. 
feel like I've done about 100 sit-ups. <laughs> <laughs>